friends, today we're going to be going inside the Merchant Update Center and specifically we are going to be reviewing the Automated Bonus module. The Automated Bonus section can be found underneath Marketing as you see here. We will be covering this section in three parts. This is part one of three and we'll be looking at the basic event bonuses and automated email templates. You've heard us say many times before, this program is an automated money making marketing machine and today we're going to dive right into the heart of the engine. The growing list of small business owners using Membership Rewards 365 tell us they love this part of our program the most. Unlike many other methods to advertise your business, we give you true metrics that show you how well this money making marketing machine is working for you. No guessing whether a promotion worked or didn't work, no second guessing at all. Proof is delivered to you in real time, real numbers showing the level of success of each and every promotion. Now let's jump right into the heart of this machine and see how we can start making more money with doing less with Membership Rewards 365 because that's what it's all about. Now before I dive right in here and start showing you the basic event triggers in our program, I first want to let you know we're not looking to give you more another job to do or put on another hat. We know you're wearing 14 million hats. We actually want to take some of those off of you and we want to show you how we can do it and make more money. So as we're going through this process, you're, you're gonna, you might hear me say this is our set it and forget it solution. We truly believe that you could just set this and forget it, walk away. Each client, you could set up your whole account within 10 minutes and be done. And your customers will be getting fed information that will drive them back to your business. Set it and forget it was the mentality uh, that we had on, in mind when we built this product and we'll continue to do that to develop solutions that make it easier for you to make more money in your business. So we're first going to cover off the basic event triggers and this covers a few. We've got account bonus, anniversary and birthday and we've got two more, the gift card bonus, the thank you note that are included as well. So first let's start off with account activation bonus. Every customer that joins your program is going to be given something. Maybe it's a, uh, if it's a bowling center, it's a game of bowling or an appetizer, but you can also give them a, a, a monetary amount, $5 or $10, whatever it might uh, get them to give you their data. So let's set up the first bonus. And this demo account is a steakhouse, so keep that in mind as we uh, go through this process. So we have the option to set the expiry date. We could set it for one day if we wanted, but we wouldn't do that for an account activation bonus. We like to think that you would give them something that is good for one year. So in this case we could say it's good for one year and we have the option here to give a fixed reward or an appetizer. So a fixed reward would be five dollars. Maybe we'd give steak lovers ten dollars. Because the steak lovers is these are people who have paid for a membership or maybe they're just people who you want to treat extra special. So let's, instead of giving them $5 and $10, let's give them, uh, let's go up here and change this to appetizers. And let's give our people who, who are regular customers one appetizer, but for those really elite special customers, our steak lover members, we're going to give them four appetizers. Simply just save, it's ready to go. Now we know and this is important in any business, it's really important in the in the steakhouse business, anniversary and birthdays, these special occasions that hit the calendar. We don't want to miss opportunities and not have the right message going out to our, our members letting them know, hey, why don't you join us for uh, your birthday or anniversary. So here we have the anniversary bonus set up and again we can choose the expiry. We suggest that you put it to one month, that gives them plenty of time to use it and drives them into your your business uh, uh, sooner. And in this case we're going to put a fixed reward. We're going to give our regular members five dollars and we're going to give our steak lover members ten. Simply press save and it's ready to go. You'll notice over here we've got this you know warning message pops up. It's going to, these are put in so that you don't make any mistakes. In this case we have a pre-anniversary email that goes out. This goes out ten days before your customer's anniversary comes up. And what happens here is they get this email sent to them and it, it, it's customized with their name and it tells their bonus. In this case the uh, restrictions are already put in place 30 days but you might have to change this. You can customize this content. You can put in a uh, two can dine 
a deal, whatever it is you want to do. And all you have to do is set, click Enabled here. And we'll do the same thing on our, on our uh, Happy Anniversary as well. So we have that done. We'll just click Enabled and we're ready to go. We're done. You could send yourself a test if you wanted to as well. Just simply punch in your email address here. But you're, you're ready to go. So let's go back here and look at that. We just completed the anniversary one. I already have the, the birthday one done. And again, we're, we're setting it up for a one month expiry. This may be two, could be two months, whatever, one week, whatever you like. And we're going to jump right down here. I'm going to show you the days of the week bonus. This is one of my favorite and everyone loves this one. This, this will allow you to set up a promotion rather than doing uh, half price apps or happy hour. Why not put all that money in your till and give people a reason to come back, give them a cash back reward. So in this case, on Mondays, the steakhouse is offering from 3 p.m. to 6 p.m. They're going to give their customers uh, a reward multiplier. They're going to give them more cash back rewards when they spend money. So at this restaurant, the customers, their regular members are going to get 20% cash back rewards. And the steak lovers, they're going to get 40% cash back rewards on every purchase they make. So between 3 and 6 p.m. on Mondays, the, the system's going to track your members. They know It knows exactly you know, who's the steak lover member and who's your regular member, and it's going to give rewards based on that. You don't have to do anything. That's a great one. We love that one. Now we want to jump right down here to gift load bonus. Now we know this steakhouse would sell lots of gift cards at Christmas, but we want to actually sell gift cards year round all the time because it's a huge revenue source. Now wh how are we going to do that? We're going to offer promotions throughout the course of the year. Maybe we say load your uh, gift card balance in your card and we're going to give you a 20% bonus. So in this case, uh, the customer's going to put a hundred bucks on their gift card and they're going to get a 20 percent bonus maybe we give the steak lovers 30 percent because they're a premium member so they're going to get thirty dollars added to their account on top of the hundred so that's a great way to to get people putting prepaying you for their future visits we suggest this strategy not only happen during holiday season push it out take your slower periods you know make that reward uh, um, you know something that customers want to, to load money on their gift card and come back more often. I'm going to jump right down here to the bottom. You're seeing a lot of these other event triggers that are in here and these are all for our premium uh, event bonuses. So if you not don't have that set up in your account we might suggest that you talk to your sales rep and say hey what's it going to take to get these all these other uh, event triggers because we've got you know 20 of them just there in holidays not including overdue visits or uh, top patron appreciation. You have your thank you note here that's included in your package in the basic and with this thank you note we have the ability to actually s customize the message. So right now it the logo of the business will pop up. It will say the first name of the individual. It will tell them their balances, all this information. But if you've got special events happening throughout the week we highly recommend that you include that information in here. You know if they're running fundraisers you'll see their fundraiser totals here or their their the the group that they're part of you know this is a really great uh promotional piece that goes out every time a customer visits your business the next day they're going to end up getting this message and we get a lot of people coming back and saying oh thank you uh you know for for the message so that's covering the basic event bonuses and and uh automated email templates join us for part 2 of this three-part series. We'll be talking about the premium. Thank you.